Hey everyone, another zigzag thing that I really, really like. You know, there's huge differences culturally between the Occident and the Orient, the East and the West. And it's one of the reasons that I love to live in countries where there's, you know, slack in the system, as I call it. There's something that I saw happen in India at the beginning of the year when I was in Mumbai. I was with a friend and she and I were in a taxi and I saw that the meter was broken. And I was just about to say to the taxi driver, hey, we've got to agree the price before we get in, before we start our journey, once we got in to the taxi. And my friend tapped my leg and said, and hinted that she had it under control and she's Indian. And all throughout this long taxi ride, I was kind of anxious and fretting because I don't like the full on, you know, explosion of different opinions on what the price should be. And when we got to our destination, my friend got out of the taxi and I followed her. And just before the taxi driver spewed out a number, probably a huge number, she took out the money and she put it through the window on the passenger seat and we walked away. And the way I see it, this is zigzag think because she was suddenly in the power position because she had taken the taxi to where she wanted to go. So she was thinking differently than we do in Europe. In Europe, we'd need to establish what the price was at the beginning. But by using the guy's services, getting where she wanted to go, my friend was in this dominant position. Okay, it's a bit hardcore, but, <laughs> but I think she paid the going rate rather than the fictional, fantastical rate that taxi drivers in Mumbai love to ask for.